The regional and international implications of the Ethiopia Somaliland MOU. Hello, and welcome to Newsfest Addis, your daily source of news bites locally, regionally, and internationally. The recent Memorandum of Understanding MOU between Ethiopia and Somaliland has sparked a diplomatic crisis in the Horn of Africa, with Somalia rejecting the deal and accusing Ethiopia of violating its sovereignty. The MOU, which was signed on 31st December 2023, grants Ethiopia access to the port of Berbera in Somaliland, a self-declared independent state that is internationally recognized as part of Somalia. In return, Ethiopia pledges to support Somaliland's bid for recognition and development. The deal has been hailed by Ethiopia and Somaliland as a historic and strategic partnership that will boost trade, security, and regional integration. Ethiopia, a landlocked country with a population of over 100 million, has been seeking alternative routes to the sea especially after its relations with neighboring Eritrea deteriorated following a border war in the late 1990s. Somaliland, a former British protectorate that declared independence from Somalia in 1991, has been seeking international recognition and investment to develop its economy and infrastructure. However, the deal has been met with strong opposition and condemnation from Somalia, which considers Somaliland as a breakaway region and claims sovereignty over its territory. Somalia has declared the MOU null and void, and recalled its ambassador to Ethiopia for consultations. Somalia's president, Hassan Sheikh Mohamud, has also reaffirmed his country's stance on its territorial inviolability and accused Ethiopia of interfering in its internal affairs. Somalia argues that the deal violates the principles of the African Union, AU, and the Intergovernmental Authority on Development, IGAD, which both uphold the respect for the unity, sovereignty, and territorial integrity of Somalia. The MOU has also raised concerns among other regional and international actors who fear that it could escalate tensions and instability in the Horn of Africa, a strategically important and volatile region that faces multiple challenges such as terrorism, piracy, drought, and migration. The United States, the European Union, the Arab League, and the AU have all called for diplomatic dialogue and restraint among the parties involved and urged them to respect the existing agreements and frameworks on the resolution of the Somali issue. The U.S. in particular has reaffirmed its acknowledgement of the sovereignty and territorial integrity of Somalia, as defined within its 1960 borders, and expressed its serious concern about the resulting spike in tensions in the region. The MOU between Ethiopia and Somaliland reflects the changing dynamics and interests in the Horn of Africa, as well as the complexity and diversity of the Somali question. The deal poses a dilemma for the international community, which has to balance its support for Ethiopia's development and regional role with its commitment to Somalia's sovereignty and stability. The deal also challenges the existing norms and institutions that govern the region, such as the AU and IGAD, which have to deal with the reality of Somaliland's de facto statehood and Ethiopia's growing influence. The MOU, therefore, requires a careful and constructive engagement from all stakeholders, as well as a comprehensive and inclusive approach to address the root causes and aspirations of the Somali people. This was our news analysis for today. Thank you very much for staying with us. Make sure to join us for another edition of NewsFest Addis.